doggies and our dingoes, the dingo H.O. baby. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Kurt. Welcome to this super ultra widescreen presentation of Forza Horizon 3. That's right, we played Forza Horizon 2 and we were gallivanting along the coastline of the Mediterranean and now we're going hey. to yeah, Australia. The new boss is already Jelly old right. Australia. Right we're gonna get now. some blooming onions. Put some shrimp on the barbie and other such overused, okay, perhaps mildly racist <laughs> remarks to be made about Australians. But yeah, Forza Horizon 3, of course, a game uh, that I appreciate a little bit more than the Forza Motorsport series because it, it knows that it's a console arcade racer and it embraces that. So I'm looking forward to embracing it here. The hype, the hype is still here. <laughs> There's still a lot of hype. The party atmosphere, I feel about 15 years too old for the, the demographic <laughs> that they are, uh, they're attaching themselves to, but we already, we had all that fun with the first Forza Horizon. I think we'll try to approach this with a different attitude, I suppose. I am playing on the Xbox One, by the way. When you do purchase this, you get it both for Xbox One and Windows 10. So I had a choice to make, but I decided to stick with the Xbox One because uh, it's a little bit easier. Our friend Cone Dodger, if you want to see how it performs and plays on, on Windows 10 PC, you can go watch Cone Dodger's playthrough, but apparently we could if we want to do multiplayer together. It's, it's cross-platform, so I decided to just uh, get some use out of this giant box of technology. Oh god! We're driving. I forgot that this is something that they do in these games. It's, it's suddenly, you are now driving 151 miles per hour in a Lamborghini thingamabob but a tood. Brakes. I don't need no brakes. Okay, I need brakes. Okay, all right, all right. Trying to remember how to drive. Drive to the festival site. To the site of the festival. All right. Woo. Okay. Things are getting flung. Things are getting flung about. This low low bridge. So we're driving. Ah, such hydroplaning. We're driving a uh, Lamborghini. There's a Ferrari, there's a Konung Zug Zig Zig up ahead. And then of course the Ford. Excuse me! Ferrari drivers, am I right? Out of the way, jerk ass. Alright, alright. This car does not have the mo Whoa! Okay, that was unexpected. It's like No Man's Sky. It just suddenly goes into super ultra widescreen mode to tell you about a uh, an achievement. All right, now oh god, now we're driving a brake overhaul, Warren. I left the thing this thing for a brake overhaul. Oh, good idea, Kira. What you say something about brakes? So now I'm we're taking the great Oh god, playing as this guy? Just please, do we change do characters? Dorifto, oh, too much drifto. Oh, well, that's the handbrake. Oh, that was too much handbrake. Oh, we're dead. Rewinds. Oh, I'm getting choked up. You know what it is? It's these two gigantic spare tires that we're carrying. Causing a bit of a strange balance. Oh, we lost the radio. Okay, that's a nice touch. Because we're, cause we're underground. Beep, beep. Mess up your brand new truck. Oop. Oh, hey, where do you think you're going? Woo! Sorry. We all know how my drivatar is going to behave now. I'm running into people. Okay, this is a fairly straightforward drive. It's not much. Oop, and then into widescreen mode, alright. We did it, everybody. We did it. Together. We can do anything. 
All right, now let's actually let them speak. I was trying to talk as much as possible over that intro scene because I've heard on the grapevine that some YouTube channels are entering that into their content ID system to claim anybody who uploads the intro to Forza Horizon 3. So screw you! Screw you, I say! Bring it on, content ID system! I have, I have all the disputes. Disputes for days! All right. All right. All right. Bob, oh. The local press are asking for a photo. Ah. Uh, ha. Didn't I? I'm not claiming responsibility. I'm claiming responsibility. But didn't I have a bit of a beef, a vintage beef? No, a a, a beef to pick with the last game about the fact that. You just had to be a dude. <laughs> you just had to be this spiky-haired dude. Like this guy. You had to be this dude. And could be nothing else in the last game. And I said, hey, what's up with that? Apparently, this is what's up with that. What the heck? It's, it's, it's Lizzie. It's LD Shadow Lady, everybody. Um, of course, I have zero of anything in common with any of these individuals as well. So... I think both Beef and Cone chose this guy, because he's the only one with a beard. You know what? To mark the occasion, however, of our newly found artificial diversity in Forza Horizon 3, um, let's, let's pick, just because it's funny, we're going to play, since LD Shadow Lady doesn't play racing games, <laughs> we're going to play as the pink-haired... Your character can be changed. Oh, we can change. If we decide we want to be somebody else, we, we can be whoever we want to be. Confirm character choice. Yes! Okay. I am and Kurt. <laughs> Boy, that's a that's a funny name for a girl. Um, how about Lance? Leonardo? Nick? <laughs> Quinton? Is Kurt... Oh, did I miss that? Oh, Kurt is one. Well, that's funny. I mean, well, I guess not too funny. These are a lot of names. Zane? Zane? What about some... Is Lizzie? Is Lizzie? That's getting kind of weird. I'm not intending to... Uh, Lindsay? Lily? Lydia? Is Glidia? Is Glidia a name? Lizzie isn't a name. I suppose it could be a nickname. Abraham Lincoln! Abraham Lincoln! Oh my gosh. All right, so I guess the demographic hasn't changed at all. El Pollo Diablo, G. How about we just be G? Is Ice? Ice would be good. Uh, I was looking for... Speedy! We can be Speedy! That makes me sad to think about all of a sudden. Thanks a lot, video game! Frickin... Dead pets? What the heck? Noob... My lord! My lady! Sorry, this is, this is what this episode is gonna be. <laughs> uh, hey, fella! There aren't that many female-ish sounding names. What was I looking for? Lizzie. Uh, I kind of like Guy. Hey, Guy. Monkey. Mr. President. Uh, okay, there's no L's at all here. Legend. Luis. Loco. Lee. Lopez. Jones. The Dark Lord. Perhaps I should be the Dark Lord. Let's be... Abraham Lincoln, Brantosaurus Rex, wow, Cannonball, Bort, Bort, yes, yes, <laughs> that, now that is a Simpsons reference I can get behind. I kind of want to choose that just for the fun. All right, let's just do one really quick sweep here. Uh, I don't see ice. Oh, there's no eyes at all. That stinks. Ice or Iceman. I guess they don't have the rights to use Formula One driver nicknames. Titan, Wallaby. Oh, Dingo is Dingo. I'm gonna go with either Dingo or Bort. Uh, Drongo, driver. Like, driver San Francisco, but no Dingo. That stinks. Uh, I wanna be Bort, <laughs> just because uh, it makes no sense other than 
I'll call you Bort. <laughs> Bort, with your very thick Australian accent. That went a little bit Irish there when I was doing it, but that's all right. I'm the festival boss. Hey, Bort. Oh dear, Bort needs it to. It may not look it yet, but over the summer you're going to turn this into the cover. biggest horizon. Well, no, you, you can wear whatever you want, Bort. Wear whatever you want. I wasn't about to just go back on my old diversity and everything by telling somebody what to wear. The type of racing we do, the music we play, and the star drivers we sign. This is your festival. I own it. Listen, I know you've just arrived, but the very first event starts in a few minutes, and I've got you the best seat in the house. It doesn't sound like the voice is coming out of the character who's speaking to me. There's a little bit of a disconnect there. But that's alright. We can deal. Off the chain. That was incredibly hazardous, Bort. Thought I'd start you off with an easy one. Let you loosen up. I said easy, not boring. Sounds like we're talking to her over the phone. <laughs> but she's standing right next to us. That's alright. Alright, so there, here's our tutorial mission. I assume... Oh, hey, go! We don't even get a countdown anymore in this video game. Uh, how do you change cameras? Okay, I like the further away camera. Okay, that was terrible. Wait for me! All right, there's a guy in the jeep being flown about by the, uh, what is that, a Chinook helicopter? Trying to avoid the trees. Whilst a pink-haired pink girl named Bort <laughs> is uh, chasing down in a buggy. And maxing out the rev limiter here. And we've caught up! Almost as if it was scripted for us to do so. Alright. Okay, water effects on the screen. You know how much a fan I am of those. Okay, we just destroyed some poor family's roof. <laughs> Good job. These dang kids. First, they destroyed entire lives in Southern Europe. And now they're doing the same here in the Southern Hemisphere. But it's the time of our lives, everybody! <laughs> oh, man. Aliyup. They are really proud of their water effects. And, uh... Aquaplaning that they've added since the first or since the last uh, Forza Motorsport game. So I think we can expect hefty usage of such things in this game. Whoa, watch the trees. All right. Oh, oh, I overcooked that turn a little bit. Downshift. Downshift. Oh, he's taking out signs and stuff. That's a hazard. Bullet time. Okay, he's stand. This is dangerous. This man wants to die. He's standing up in the. Oh god, spinning out into trees. Standing up in a jeep that's being hoisted about. Well, they've certainly. Piled on the the arcade racer. Even they've embraced it, my friends. Take out all the cones. Pass up the objective. First place. Even though I had that mess up very early on there. Fans. Oh. This is very similar to, remember Grid? Grid 2, actually. Grid 2 worked on the YouTube fans' basis of points. Nice driving, boss. Name's Warren. Resident Don't call Carter. me boss. Call me Bort. I know you're in charge. Get it right. Your bloke in the garage. So you need anything car-related, you come to me. 
Oh, one more thing before we go, though. Kira said you might want to drive the Centenario. The Centenario? Isn't it the Centenario? Like cent, like a century? Am I not We're starting to bring understanding my name Lamborghini the naming order. nomenclature? Most of them just want a chance to line up next to you. I say we give it to them. There's a driver I've had my eye on around here. Find them. Beat them in a race, and we can sign the driver to up to the Beat them with a sock full of pennies, and then we can sign them up. <laughs> oh, okay, so we gotta find the driver somewhere over there. And we're starting in the rainforest. Does Australia have rain board <laughs> rainforests? Find pause on pause! Oh, we're gonna take out pause, unpause. That's right. Surprised it didn't choose somebody who's actually playing the game. Although, actually, you know what? Pause plays every game, so I wouldn't be surprised even if he's not... Oh, that's the handbrake. Uh, even if he's not playing on, like, stream or for video, he's probably just playing for fun. In, in most driving games I play with the controller, B? B is the handbrake? It's A in this game. So I've got to kind of remap my memory here. Oh, 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 thread the needle! Oh, God! That's right. You better give me those thousand points and call it threading the needle after I already did. Woo! Oh! I have no insurance! Whoa, that was close. Oh, that was overcooking it. All right. Oh, well, I can't. We're in cutscene mode. Pause. It's pause is in the Ferrari. Ah. Uh, what do I got to do? X challenge. Ah. And then hit him in the bumper. He's in the Ferrari. The Ferrari. I think not. Woo. Ah. Get on the road. Get on the road, man. All right. Thank you. So much speed. Bear. There's bears. Oh, you guys. Oh, you guys drive on the wrong side of the road here, don't you? That's going to be problematic for me. Making right turns from the left lane. Who does such a thing? Oh, he's catching. Pause is catching. He's got a draft. I think not. Uh-oh. 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 Traffic. Beep, beep. 207 miles an hour. 210. Alright, it told me that I could have taken that flat out, but I didn't believe it. Oh, I win! I was trying desperately not to kill myself, so I completely missed that it was the end of the thing. Oh, he's so sad. <laughs> pause on pause is so sad. The more drivers you get to join your lineup, the more fans will attract to the festival. I'll let you know next time we've identified a potential lineup recruit. Thanks. What was your name again? I forgot her name. Susan? Is it Susan? <laughs> that would be uh, appropriate. Drive to the beach. Drive to the beach. I am keeping left, thank you. Because I'm sure the Lamborghini Centenario does great on the soft sandy beaches. Woo! Actually, it kind of does. Uh, the sand certainly does have a... doesn't really slow you down much, but it has a... Not slippery, but... A, a, a... Oh, yeah. Okay, maybe slippery. Oh, God! And he takes out the four cars waiting for him. Good job! Keep up the good work. Alrighty then. Okay, no. Boss. boss. Really it's Bort. Fans and it's Bort. We need to Warren. Warren. For that, you'll need your car. All right. Beef chose the Sylvia. I know Cone chose the uh, the Ute, which I would be tempted to do as well. Although that one isn't all that attractive. I'm kind of. Kind of uh, tempted to take the M4 Coupe, because 
It looks and seems like a cool car if you have a lot of money and could afford such a thing. So I'm, I think I'll go with the BMW. This is a little bit uh, not quite my normal MO, but I'll, I'll go with it. I'll go with it, all right. Ooh. I knew it'd be that one, the way your eyes lit up when you saw it. They really didn't, honestly. <laughs> I was quite uh, unenthused about all the choices, to be completely honest with you, but thanks! At least it's left-hand drive, that'll not do anything for me since I'm racing in third-person view anyway. How about a Edit your license plate. Hmm. Hmm. Edit your license plate. What should it be? I know. I know exactly what it should be. What do these stickers mean? Uh... I'm sure there's something else. Oh my gosh. I don't know the alphabet <laughs> to know where to start rolling the dice here. Alright. Oh, you know what? This Can I make it a blank space? Or a dash? Or something? Oh, there can't be. Oh yeah, there can. Alright. It's gonna be the sub tub! I don't know. I don't know why this is going up on YouTube and not even up on Twitch, but it just sounds funny. Sub tub. Ah, <laughs> uh, I get a kick out of things. <laughs> this Horizon Festival is going to be big, bigger than ever before. Ooh. We're going to need to expand our festival site. But to do that, we need fans. We're going to have to, to bring in fans, we need force people to move out of their homes. Races and performing PR We're stuff. like the Olympics. Our festival scouts have been hard at work mapping points of interest with these markers. Set a route to a marker and let's see what we can find. Uh, so we're going to markers. Undiscovered route. Undiscovered PR stunt. Undiscovered route. And what is this? This is... But we need to, we need to earn... 7,000 fans before going to the Horizon Festival. So I guess let's let's do this since it's a little bit of a distance away. Try some different things. I'm on signing a whole range of oh, music labels and uh, but it's your no, call, I'm actually gonna mute. I'm gonna mute the music. Thank you very much. Sure. Can I skip this? Radio. Indie and alternative rock. Alternative rock. Get the deal signed. Who's next? Uh, nobody really, but I guess the Black Party. Sure, the Pulse, the Pulse. Done. I'll get Horizon Pulse signed up. Slow things down. It's as easy as this, kids, to sign promotional sponsorships for your YouTube channel. Uh, so now how do I? Whoops, that's wrong. Uh, all right, let let's look very quickly at the settings. Uh, such as the difficulty. Let's do challenging. ABS will remain on. Steering will remain normal. Traction control. Hmm. Might leave that on. Automatic shifting. Driving line. Braking only. Cosmetic and rewinds are on. Okay. We got a 40% bonus. Uh, I accept your bonus. Let's also go to the audio. And turn the radio off. Well, turn the radio down to one. <laughs> Again, taking a page out of Codemasters, which allows you to turn the volume down only to 50%. Uh, everything else shall remain the same. I accept. And video. Oh, that this I already did before the game started, so hopefully everything looks right. HUD and gameplay. Units. Units. Anyone can join me. No, I don't think we're going to let that happen. Only friends, thank you very much. Uh, okay. Alright, accept. Don't get any ideas joining your favorite YouTubers games. Uh, the controls are fine. 
characters, name select. All right, I think I'm I'm all right with the the setups and the difficulties and the uh Okay, I probably have, would have been able to do a much more impressive donut there with the traction control off, but that's all right. We can deal with it. Uh how do you change fancy interior? Ooh. Ooh, those are weird. Uh, that I suppose is that an aerodynamic reason In 400 yards, for the uh, side view mirrors to be whoa like that. Flappy pedals. All right, honestly, I think for for starters here, hood view. The the third person camera I think matches the game the most. Whoa! In 100 yards, turn right. Okay, good thing these break and don't actually prevent me from going where the car could shouldn't be. All right. I turned down the radio, Amy Simpson. It's Corrales, everybody. Turn left. Whoop! Taking out the shrubbery. Dip. You're a dip. We call it a dip. Okay, uh, we're doing this now. Shortcut. In 400 yards, turn Sorry. Dorifto! Alright, now I'm starting to get the hang of it again. In 200 yards, turn left. Liberal use of the handbrake. Turn left. Aw, yes. I might have to turn off uh, traction control to make those sort of moves a little bit more encourageable. This is a circuit race. Bort. All asphalt route. Specified number of laps. Sounds simple enough. Sounds All simple right. enough. People want to see you racing, so let's start things off with a single race exhibition. Don't mind if I do. The super saloons. Saloons, everybody. Saloons. <laughs> All right. And fade. Ooh, the Audi. Ooh, that's uh, the, the, the wagon that isn't available in the United States. Uh, start race event. I did turn up the difficulty, remember? We can tune our vehicle I don't they I think they left too much of this stuff in from Forza Motorsport I don't think it's that important in this game at all uh, but let's just start the race events and get proven wrong just how unimportant it is oh go god I really would like a countdown maybe it's vintage beef everybody vintage beef Alright, this is a circuit race, so maybe, whoops, don't hit the walls. Hi, Corrales, sorry. Alright, this car is definitely very heavy. These kind of sweeping turns are no, doing no favors for it. Whoa! A Tesla? I, I know how these Teslas drive. I bought one in Forza 5. Should not be up here with the rest of us, I'm afraid. Oh, that, that, okay, that turn you don't have to break for. I'll remember that next time. Uh oh, the rain, the rain! Good thing I left traction control on. Jeebus. Pawns all. Ah, oh, yes, we are playing a console game, aren't we? Uh, now correct me if I'm wrong. I was trying to decide uh, between playing on the PC and the Xbox and trying to look at like comparisons or whatever. And there's like little little things that say, oh, the view distance is a little bit further on the PC. Um, you know, some textures are a little bit higher 
I mean, especially for playing in 1440p mode, which the Xbox can't do. Uh, and I can't do it because I don't have a 1440p monitor. But I swears, I swears, unless they've changed it with an update, that even the PC version, the Windows 10 version, is locked at 30 frames. All right, this is the turn you don't got to slow down for. Got it. That might have changed. I know there were performance issues with the game, so, you know, obviously having having never built a PC game before, this developer has to learn a thing or two about optimization. Ooh, slick! But yeah, just the, the simplicity. I mean, I suppose I'm making a case for console gaming. Certainly for games built for consoles. Playing them on the consoles, I, I agree with. Instead of trying to sight, 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 force a square peg into a round hole as I just strewn a bunch of round pegs onto the street right there. Whoops! Oh, that was a dip! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Here comes beef. I think not, my friend. Got it! First place! Chalk it up, boss. That's a win. The Thanks name's Bart! <laughs> not boss, Bart! 58 second best lap, 30665. There's Cone Dodger in fifth place. Driving a Lexus, as we all know, Cone Dodger is a big fan of Lexus automobiles. <laughs> oh, man. We got 9,000... Oh, credits, not fans. How many fans did we get? That's what I'm looking for. I need 7,000-something fans. Nope. Are you not telling me how many fans I got? There it is. We're very nearly at fan capacity. Just a few more and I can roll out the next stage of festival plans. Get you some new toys to play with. Might need, might need them to have a little buff and a wax on this one as well. Kind of messed it up a little bit. Hey, Bort. I'm your automated <laughs> Anna. natural navigation assistant. You can call me Anna. Uh, oh, wait, I keep forgetting to see, check what the other lady's name is. Back in Cambridge. I'm going to suggest things for you to do and help you find your way around Australia. For now, would you like me to set you a route to the next activity? I would like to set you set you to set me a route to the next activity. Which is strangely using the D-pad that you used to confirm. Okay. Great. If you need me again, just press down on the D-pad. Oh, she's asking for the D-pad. Like I apologize. <laughs> All right, I'm going to call this an episode here. And we will continue to the Headland Circuit in the next episode of Forza Horizon 3. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Kurt. Whoa, watch it there, guy. I will see you next time. Found the horn. Found the horn, everybody. <laughs>